Uh, hello everybody, this is Gordon Goodluck and I'm a Mevo camera user and today we're going to show a new feature of Mevo Multicam uh, which is uh, the NDI inputs. NDI is a protocol uh, developed by NewTek and uh, it's a it, it was a way for um, camera video to be sent over IP networks. What we're going to do today uh, is uh, use a software called Top Director on my iPad. And uh, with, it, with this software, when you go on air, uh, I'm not going to show a close-up of this but um, I'm just going to tell you what I'm doing in the background but uh, when you go on air with this and you have the settings set to NDI HX um, well you can set it to NDI full NDI or you can set it to NDI HX and in the uh, NDI HX you can choose H.264 compression or you can use HEVC, which is the newer style of compression. So uh, I think I'm using H264 in this case. What I'm going to do uh, is add a source. So let's see. Um, what I got to do is get it going first. So I'm going to get my source going. I'm going to put it on air. So, I'm going to turn the speaker down so I don't get some echo. So, uh, now what I'm going to do is uh, go to the Mevo app, uh, Mevo Multicam app, and uh, I'm going to hit the, the plus on the blue button, and down below uh, is NDI inputs. Down in the lower uh, part of the menu, I'm going to click on that. Now, any of the NDI inputs, any NDI sources that are on the network are being broadcasted so that you can pick whichever one you want. That's just the way NDI works. So, in this case, the one that I want to use is called Gordon's iPad <laughs> 2185, and that says top director <laughs> in parentheses, so I know that's the one. So I'm going to connect, press connect. And when I do that, there is my source. And uh, as you can see on the... I just realized you probably couldn't hear me speaking over the music. Um, hang on, I will... I'm just going to mute it for now. So, um... Anyway, that is uh, how you add an NDI source. Now, now when you want to, <coughs> when you want to uh, disconnect, what you do is go back, press the blue button again, and under NDI inputs, you select that, and you'll see a, a, um, the button for that says disconnect. So that's the only option you had. You can disconnect your source. It's going to say, do you really want to disconnect? Yes, I do. And so once it's disconnected, if you go back to your cameras, you're just going to see the one camera I have running the, uh, this is Amiibo Start that I'm speaking to you over. So, um, yeah, so that's all there is to it. Um, just got to get a little bit used to how NDI works but it's not difficult at all and I hope this helps thanks very much for watching